came out run, skirt, skirt in my car. You would have thought I stole some money. Hello YouTube, JMO1036 here. As you can see, I've modified the system information in MS Info 32 for virtual machine, but I won't be showing you how to do that in this video. I showed this in my last video, so if you'd like to see how to do this, check out the previous video. Link will be in the description, or you can always look on my channel. Subscribe and check my channel and you'll find it there. But anyways to this video see how well I'm pretty sure you guys know about this in Task Manager Virtual Machine, yes. Otherwise you probably wouldn't be here. So I'll show you how to disable that. In my last video I kind of hinted to where this might be and I went to test it and it does work you basically go to settings go to acceleration and set the virtualization interface to none I haven't tested the other options but all the other options most likely will trigger that virtual machine yes so you change that to none and then you fire up the virtual machine again and from me testing it, I actually don't see any performance loss when disabling. Other people I've heard say that they use it because they have performance loss without it, but personally I haven't seen any performance loss. And now let's go check the task manager. And as you can see, you no longer see virtual machine yes here. It's actually like a regular system. And it even says virtualization not capable, which might help when you're doing the, the scamming exposement videos but it doesn't really matter much but it could help because it will kind of give them less, than, less of a sign that it is a virtual machine I don't know why I'm shutting that off like that but most likely after this video those virtual machines won't be there anymore. I'll be deleting them. But anyway, JMO1036 is out.